how do societies invest in their own future uh, knowing that they need to do things in a different way? Is it really need driven? So do, you, do, do we start innovating when there's something wrong? Or do we also start innovating when we don't even know that something is wrong or that there might be opportunity costs involved, but we anticipate something better? So what is the role of the entrepreneur here, the social entrepreneur? What are the conditions under which we can create governance innovations where everybody is better off? Who benefits is one of those critical questions behind uh, innovation research. Innovations, of course, happens in markets, happen in, happen in business settings, technological innovations, of course, but uh, the non-profit sector, including uh, civil society more generally, has become a focus of social innovations in particular. Now, to some extent, that's a displacement of an emphasis on government as the main engine behind social innovation. There is talk about innovation in the public sector but it's usually seen as a problem. We somehow seem to have lost confidence in the public sector being the key innovator. We talk about organizational, in, the creative organizations, but the innovative organizations. Now, organizations don't innovate, it's people who do it, right? And entrepreneurs may find themselves inside and outside organizations. So it's a field that has to deal with a diversity, but also with uh, pressures with expectations. When you talk about innovations, the last thing you want to do is think about innovation as an outcome of something that can necessarily be planned for. Right? Innovations happen without a plan, they happen with the plan, but they, they may not happen according to plan because creativity is difficult to predict. You can create conditions that make creativity more likely, but you cannot really plan for it in the sense of a project where you have to count on delivery. That's the big challenge for social innovations of capturing innovations, vetting them, nurturing them, scaling up, rolling out. Mm -hmm.